Well, it's uh, Thursday. Like I told you, beautiful day. Going to be in the 70s. I'm headed to the dermatologist to get my six months checkup. And I got to pick up, I got to drop off some knives at the Cavalier Hotel. And I got to pick up some, a bunch of knives from the catering company. And a bunch of knives from uh, a local spot in Norfolk. So I have a, a good number of knives today. And I'm going to try and get to the patch this afternoon. See if there's any little buttons hanging around anywhere. Stand by. I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> I just got a call from a lady. She says, I'm in your driveway. I got some knives for you. I said, well, I'm not home. I'm picking up some knives and I'm dropping off some knives. Just set them in my little box there by the door. But I have a lot of them. I said, well, the box will hold them. I don't know how many she's got. She's got 13 of this kind, 13 of that kind, and two or three big ones, she said. Oh, man. Stand by. <laughs> Here's the first restaurant. I think it's uh, 13 or 14 knives and a pocket knife. Here's the second restaurant. I think it's 15 knives and a cleaver. <clears throat> and I'm really afraid to look in that bag right there. That's the lady I told you to call and left them in the box. Chris went out and got them. I'm overwhelmed today. I've never been overwhelmed before ever. But I guess it happens. <clears throat> Stand by, let's get them tickets out. I recognize these knives now. <clears throat> they had my sleeves on some of them. I did them for two years ago at the King's Grant Farmer's Market. But she wasn't in my phone, so I know it's King's Grant. She would have been in my book and not in my phone, not my phone. <laughs> Holy Toledo. Well, I'm getting ready to pull into my garage. Where's our food? It's uh, two minutes to eight. Okay. I got knives in the box again. I don't know what to think. I'm inundated with knives. Late night tickets. Five wares. Oh, A gathering. 